I'm a woman of a certain age. And because of that, I have to be very careful about moisturizing my skin, in particular my hands. My cuticles get very rough and dry and then I admit it, I bite on them, I worry them, and I can end up with bleeding cuticles if I'm not careful. But if I'm very conscientious about putting hand cream on, I can keep those cuticles soft and I can fight against that desire I have to nibble on my cuticles. So even if you're not a cuticle nibbler, if you do have dry hands or if your cuticles do get dry, I have four products that I highly recommend. The first one is the newest one that I've tried and it's called Lux Lotion. I don't know if you can see that, Lux, L-U-X-E Lotion. Uh, you can get it on their website. You can also find it on Amazon. Uh, I like the unscented version. Um, I don't like to be overwhelmed by my hand cream scent. I really like this because it's very it goes on really nicely. It absorbs quickly. It doesn't feel greasy on my hands. So it's kind of an everyday for me. I really like it. Now, the next one is for a much more intensive treatment. Um, if my cuticles and my hands are very, very dry, I use this at night um, because it is so thick and rich that it, um, it doesn't absorb as quickly, but it really does a good job. And it's called Aquaphor. And you can get this anywhere, grocery stores, drug stores, Amazon, whatever. And it's called uh, Aquaphor Healing Ointment. And I wanna show you what it looks like because it really is like an ointment. Uh, almost. You can see I really do use this a lot. I rub this um, into my cuticles and then onto my hands and even onto my elbows uh, and I sleep in it at night. It, it can be a little bit sticky so you really have to rub it in um, but I guarantee that if you have extremely dry cracked hands this will do the job for you. Now, the next thing I love is a kind of a surprising thing. It's called Original Sprout Scrumptious Baby Cream. It, uh, it's got a really, you know, lovely um, scent to it almost. It's very, I would say it smells like babies. And, you know, who doesn't want that? It's, it's paraben-free. Um, it is nice and, um, you know, for me, it's, see, it's a nice little cream. And it goes on super easy, absorbs really fast, and it seems to me that it lasts longer than most things. Like my skin feels soft and uh, moisturized for a longer period of time, and yet there's no stickiness and it, it doesn't you know get on any of your clothes or anything. I love this, and who doesn't love the smell of babies? Come on, it smells like baby powder. Finally, when I'm traveling, I need to have something, but I want to have something that's in a three ounce size or less because I want to take it on the plane with me and I don't like to check my luggage. For that, I have found Aveda Hand Relief to be my travel savior. And I buy it in the travel size and I keep it in my little plastic bag that I have to show when I go through um, the airport. This is a lovely cream. I mean, this. It has no scent, to me anyway. Um, it's much richer and thicker than the baby cream that I just told you about. So I rub it into my cuticles like that, rub it into my hands, and yet, even though it's richer, it absorbs quickly as well. And it really combats um, what happens to you on an airplane. Airplanes are very dehydrating. Um, and I, whenever I go overseas, um, that's, you know, that's a seven, eight hour trip of airplane air and dehydration and not drinking enough water, no matter how much you're trying. And so the Aveda Hand Relief is really my travel go-to. So just to reiterate, uh, Lux Lotion, Unscented, Aquaphor, and that is the, uh, the healing ointment, Scrumptious Baby Cream personal favorite, and the Aveda Hand Relief. All of these could be in your arsenal, and depending on what your needs are, I hope they work for you. Please let me know, and if there's something you're using that I haven't tried, I'd like to know about that too.